warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Salam Kukar Pintar. Hi everyone, how are you? I hope you're all fine. I'm Shahdatul Ashifah and in this video, we are going to learn about in order to and so that, which is the second chapter in the ninth grade. For this video, we used the government book, this one, Think Globally, Act Locally. By the end of this video, you'll be able to identify the social function, the language feature, the structure of in order to and so that, and we'll be able to use them in a short conversation. First of all, let's have a look at a video about COVID-19. Based on the video, in order to stay away from the coronavirus, we should always wash our hands. We keep distance from each other so that we don't transmit the virus to other people. We should wear masks in order to minimize the risk of getting infected from the coronavirus. Now, let's talk about in order to and so that. What are they? How do we use them? And when we use them? So, in order to or so that are conjunctions atau kata penghubung yang kita gunakan untuk menyatakan tujuan or purpose why someone do something. There are two things to highlight when we want to use in order to or so that in sentences. The purpose and action. So, which one is the purpose and which one is the action? The purpose usually comes after in order to or so that. For example, on this sentence, where do you think the purpose is? That's right. The purpose is so that we don't transmit the virus to other people. <laughs> Let's move on to the structure. Now, how do we put them in a sentence? Does the purpose go first or the action go first? To answer this question, Let's pay attention to the following sentences. So when we use in order to, the purpose can go first and the action can go second or vice versa. Atau kebalikannya. And another thing we have to pay attention to is what comes after in order to and so that. As you can see, after in order to, we use verb one. And after so that, we use subject and verb one. Let's practice on how to pronounce the words and sentences. Now everybody, 
Listen, repeat. In order to. In order to. Now your turn. Well done. Now everyone, listen, repeat. In order to stay away from coronavirus, we should always wash our hands. One more time. In order to stay away from coronavirus, we should always wash our hands. The second one is, so that. Everyone listen, repeat. So that. So that. Now it's your turn. Well done. Now everyone listen, repeat. We keep distance from others so that we don't transmit the virus to each other. Now it's time for you to practice on how to form the sentences by using in order to and so that. Number one has been done for you as an example. Now pause the video for you to do the rest of the exercise. Now, you can check your answers. Did you get all the answers correct? Now, in the following exercise, you will have to fill in the blanks with your own words. For example, the question is, why do we exercise every day? You can answer, we exercise every day in order to get fit and healthy. Remember, use the form of in order to and so that correctly. That's all about today's video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to visit, like, and subscribe to Bukan Pintar Channel from Dinas Pendidikan dan Kebudayaan Kabupaten Kutai Kartanegara. I'll see you again next time. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Salam.